Caterpillar track type tractors with CAT grade control combine automation with real time surface and performance information. Follow these instructions for basic operation. Begin by pressing the power button on the 3D display. CAT grade control status will be indicated in the lower left corner. Manual. There may be grade information, but there is no automatic function available. Auto with black text. Grade control is armed, but it is not active, and the blade is above the grade. Auto with green text. Grade control is actively controlling the height of the blade, and it is on grade. Additionally, the operator icon is green when the operator has taken control of the blade, and clear when cat grade control is moving the blade. The auto carry icon appears when auto carry is on. If it is on now, turn it off by pressing the key next to the auto carry icon. Before using cat grade control, you must have a fixed navigation satellite solution. Check this by navigating to the diagnostics screen. You must have a valid design. Use the menu key, highlight select design, scroll to the design you want, press OK and escape to return to a grade control screen. Another option is to create a new sloping plane using the onboard tools. Instructional videos are listed at the end of this video. You will have light bars with up and down arrows indicating direction to grade and a graphic of the machine positioned above or below the design and or cut and fill information that can be added to any screen. The stable blade feature is enabled by default when you start the tractor to help the operator keep the blade steady on rough ground. Anytime that the grade control is active, the stable blade is temporarily disabled. Pause the video here and practice using the manual mode only. Use the light bars or the screen to cut or fill an area close to grade. To remove the interlocks and arm grade control, unlock the hydraulics, disengage the parking brake, and place the tractor in forward gear. Press and hold the auto carry icon to select one of the two grade control modes. Rough grade control will control only the blade lift. The operator can tilt steer when the center of the blade is on grade. CAT grade control will control both the blade lift and the tilt. This will ensure accuracy across the entire blade. Grade control keeps the entire blade on the design, while rough grade allows the blade tips to go below and off the design. If you do not remove the interlocks or have not moved the machine for one minute, the auto symbol will flash red. Push the auto button off and then on again. Highlight CAT grade control and press OK. Use the left button on the blade control lever to switch between manual and auto. To change the design elevation, press the offset key, enter the change you want, up or down, and press OK. Alternatively, you can pull the trigger on the right joystick while pressing the left or right buttons to change the design elevation incrementally. The amount of the increment or decrement can be configured in the settings menu. The elevation change is shown on the display as a red line that is the elevation target and a black line that was the original elevation. It is also displayed on the bottom of the screen. When cat grade control is armed and the blade is above the grade, the auto is in black text and there is a green operator symbol. The blade will not automatically lower to the design.
As the operator begins to remove material and reaches the design, the CAT grade control becomes active. The text changes to green to show it is on grade, and the operator symbol clears to show the machine is now controlling position. When active, the operator cannot move the blade below design. CAT grade control will automatically maintain the blade on design. When you pull back on the blade control lever, the indicators once again show the operator is controlling the blade. Pause the video here and practice using the automatic grade control. Create an area that is on grade so you can use both armed and active. We will now use the auto carry with the grade control. An auto carry symbol will appear next to the operator icon. The armed or active symbols apply now to both grade control and auto carry. When auto carry is armed, the operator controls the load. But if the load becomes too large, the auto carry will become active and raise the blade to keep the tractor moving forward. If the blade is above the design, the operator icon informs you if auto carry is active. Green for armed, clear for active. Steering the tractor or pressing the decelerator will temporarily disable the auto carry. It will not move the blade. Be mindful of your hand on the blade control lever. Any lift or lower command changes the auto carry from active back to armed, and the auto carry will not be able to raise the blade to maintain traction. For full instructions, read the machine operation and maintenance manual. Additional videos are available.